โอ้รู้จักมัน Hey hold up guys I think I found something I believe this monolith marks the entrance to an ancient Thori shrine What's a Thori The Thori were mythical beings described in the oldest underland folk tales Archaeologists believe they were ancestral deities of the underland Let's see what else there is to discover on this mural That kinda looks like a tree. Yes, I think you're right. I believe it is the Great Asili Tree. Cool. So, what's that? According to the ancient scripture, the Great Asili Tree was planted at the center of the Valley of Roots in the early days of the universe. It is believed to carry the world among its many branches, holding up everything above the mist. It was said that the roots of the Asili tree contained an ancient mystical power, a power so great that it could bring the dead back to life. Ooh. So who is the big guy? I believe that figure symbolizes one of the Thori. I can't tell which one it is, but judging from what I can see, I presume he was very popular. Well, yes, possibly. If we could just remove some of the vines, I should be able to decipher the runes with the help of Kanan Dodo's book. Good idea. What you need? Well, I think Kito has the machete, but where did he go? <laughs> hey, Buona! Check this out! I'll be right there, buddy. It's the journal of the journey down. That old book has really been through a lot. So, who are all those little guys? The Thori were revered spirits of the underland. Often depicted in human or animal form, together they maintained the balance of nature and guided the living and ancestral spirits through life. I spent countless hours studying these legends back at the university in Saint Armando. That is Marushaka, the Thori of the Marushaka River, said to rule all living things in the water. Where are we now? We're in the caves of Kweiromoshi. Some 200 miles from the Hatari Reef, according to the maps, these caves are the only passage that can take us through to the Marushaka River. It is only thanks to your father, Captain Kaunin Dodo, and the incredible book he left behind, that we can navigate through the Underland. Good thing he wrote down all those notes during his early expedition. Yes, without his book, we'd be completely lost down here, and it'd be impossible to decipher these ancient writings. Somehow, I'm certain that the Journal of the Journey Down has got something to do with Kanan Dodo's disappearance. There must be something of incredible value hidden within the pages of this book. Why else would the power company go to such great lengths to find it? That there is Oganon, the tiger form predator Thori, who was believed to bring good fortune in hunting. There's Log Asha. The Thori of storms, worshipped for protection from hurricanes and floods. That is our Quan, the great Eagle Thori, king of everything that flies and protector of the underland. Oh, that's one brutal skull man! <laughs> Whoops! I forgot I put the cacti in there. <laughs> I told you that was a bad idea. Cacti rule. Hmm. I can't find a machete anywhere. I think I saw Kito using the machete last. Why don't you go ask him? Okay. Oh, 
Oh, and be careful. If the caves ahead have been used for sacrifice to the Thalri, the sacred chamber is probably well guarded. The journal specifically mentions traps and a complex series of... Okay, careful. Gotcha. Wahoo-hoo-hoo-wee! How'd you get up there, man? Hey, Kito! I need that machete! Come down from there! <laughs> no way, Mon! Check it out! I'm flying! Hmm, must be remnants from some old expedition. I wonder if Count Andordo was here. Oh man, it's empty! Cool, glowy mushrooms! Looks like they're somehow living off of the hot air coming from below. Ah, I love my old cacti. Time to come down from there, man! <laughs> <laughs> I know the cacti would come in handy one day. You okay, man? <laughs> Not the scratch. Good. You still got the machete? Sure, man. Thanks, Keto. Make way for Buana's archaeological adventures. It can't be! Can't be what? This must be the tomb of Niakazo. Who? Niakazo. According to myth, he was an immensely powerful Thori king whose evil reign drained the underland of all life, even causing the great Asili tree to wither. What was Niakazo up to anyways? According to underland mythology, Niakazo was a tyrant who ruled the world for a thousand years. But some scholars believe that Niakazo may have actually been a metaphor for some sort of natural disaster. Or maybe an ancient plague. I believe this monolith is some sort of warning. A warning left for us. Oh, maybe we should have read it before we went inside. Well. There's no point looking back now. We have to find another way out of here. Don't worry, Lena. I'm working on it. Great. I can see straight up to the clouds from here. I wish we had some wings. We could fly right out. What's this? Try it, Mon. Maybe it opens a door or something. <laughs> I'm pretty sure it's some kind of booby trap, man. <laughs> you chicken, Buana? Something tells me I'm gonna regret this. Woo! <laughs> 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 that was close. Whoa! Check this out, Keto. Wow, this place is crazy, man! Looks like there used to be some kind of artifact on this pedestal. But whoever came here ahead of us must have taken it with them. It's probably another booby trap. You're chicken? Oh, come on, man. I'm not chicken. Come on, press it! What you crazy, man? Chicken. No. Chicken, 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 chicken. Oops. <laughs> oh, <no>! <laughs> <laughs> wow. 
Wow, that was awesome, man. <laughs> it bent all the hair off my head. Man, you haven't had hair since we were kids. <laughs> I think I better just lay low for a while anyways. That was a pretty close call, man. <laughs> One more time. Hey, you doing okay, Kito? <laughs> All good here, Buana. Just a little shot from the fire, but doing good. This has got to be that near Kazo guy that Lina was talking about. I can't reach it. That ain't gonna work. I can't reach it from here. This has got... Oh, it's still all nice and warm from the hot air. Whoever made this expedition, they're long gone now. I wonder if they found what they were looking for. It's some kind of fun. Feels like a... Hmm, if I had some rope, I bet I could tie these together. Hey, Lena, guess what I found? I'm guessing a booby trap. <laughs> yeah, how'd you know? You just destroyed the only way back to the mountainside. And I think the entire cave is collapsing into the lava stream. We need to find another way out. Good idea. Kito and I will figure something out. Ah, these vines might come in handy. Good idea, but... Whoever made... I wonder... I'll just tie the vines to the crate here. I'll tie the fungus to the vines over the hole. Ah, fits perfectly! Alright, now let's pump some hot air into this baby. Time to get ready for takeoff! <laughs> What you talking about? <laughs> Just watch this. Hey, it's working, man! It's working! <laughs> well, I guess you were right. You really can count on Buana's charters. going on here? It's the Armando Power Company! They're destroying the Underland Man! It's the us! A crash! Thank God you made it! Quick, get in here! You've got to see this! What is this place? 